Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So my name is Reagan, and for today's video, I'm going to be trying on every sweatshirt slash crew neck that I own. And I have done a different version of this video before, where I tried on every t-shirt I own. So definitely when you're done with this video, check that out. Y'all seem to like it. And I'm also doing this video partly because I always want to buy new sweatshirts or crew necks or whatever to convince myself. I don't need any more and also just to go through any um, that are possibly too small and that I need to donate or whatever so yeah let's just go ahead and get started with this video um, but anyway this is the first sweatshirt and it is a Disney World one from me and my mom when me and my mom went on a trip in 2018 this is what the back looks like um, I like how the sleeves are kind of long um, but it's pretty short otherwise like I can wear it with shorts and stuff and overall it's just like a comfy nice zip up jacket that's just easy to throw on wherever I go so this one right here is obviously a crew neck and it is from the summer camp I go to every summer and I love it because it's like a perfect in between thin and thickness for Texas in the winter time and um, this is the overall length of it I like um, again how the sleeves are longer and it's super soft and cozy this is more my one I find if it gets dirty or whatever, so I'll wear it to like campfires um, or anything like that. So this next one right here, I typically wear more as an outfit instead of just to throw over when I'm cold. But it is a OU kind of quarter zip up. It has that there. I like the two different colors it has on it and the back says Oklahoma. So I definitely like this. I might need to donate this because it's very short um so yeah it's definitely getting a little bit small this one i absolutely love to wear in the winter time i love how just simple it is and again i wear this one as an outfit not like to bring with me in case i get cold but the textures um this is kind of what the textures like but it's super soft and um pretty thick but i just love how simple it is and the way it like shapes down here um and it kind of goes open like that and it's longer in the back and of course it has the hood and the drawstrings but I just love this one and it's so comfortable and simple that you can kind of add pops of color with jewelry and stuff too if you want um, and this one I believe was from Tyler's if you have that around you um, so this one is one of my favorite sweatshirts I own first off I just love the color um, on me especially since I have blue eyes it makes them pop more but I love the general sizing of this and this is my go-to for if it's um, pretty cold outside because it's one of my thickest sweatshirts I own and I it's just so so comfortable um, and again it's just for my summer camp so it just says can I go camps on it and I like that the hood is um, a different color so yeah so this one is a crew neck I got when we went to Hawaii last summer and I really like it I like the color it's definitely different for me and it just says Lahaina Maui Hawaii on it and it's super duper thin so it's great if it's like 65 ish degrees outside to just wear with shorts like I am now and it's just overall super soft but nice light and airy so this sweatshirt is from Universal Studios we went there for one day I'd say maybe two years ago and I really like the way it fits on me and I prefer wearing this one with shorts as well um, it's definitely something I want to pick normally pick out like the stripes and everything but I really like the way it looks and I'm glad I grabbed it one actually used to be my mom's and I honestly don't think I've ever worn it and I might donate this as well because it's super tight in the arms um, and everything I'm just not sure if I'll wear it consider I haven't worn it now um, so I'll probably be donating this one this one I believe is from Aviva and it might just look like a normal t-shirt but I consider it like a sweatshirt crew neck type material it's definitely fuzzy on the inside and is on the thicker side but I love this color on me. It is getting a little short, but I think it's definitely keepable. And I like this little, like, a detail at the bottom here where it kind of crosses. But this is the sweatshirt I wear for going to, like, a nicer restaurant, but I want to be cozy. Um, so it's not super soft on the inside at all. Um, but on the outside, it's really fuzzy. And um, it looks good with, like, jeans or leggings or whatever. And, yeah, the material is kind of like that. Uh fuzzy material like that and this is my nice sweatshirt so yeah so this hoodie is I have to say my all-time favorite go-to hoodie first off I just love this color on me and um, it's from Victoria Canada we went on a cruise to Alaska and had an excursion there 
Um, so we were only there for a few hours. But I also like the drawstrings. It says like Kenneth. So I just like all the overall details to it. It's super soft, comfortable, a little on the thicker side for a sweatshirt. Um, but yeah, I love this sweatshirt and will definitely be keeping it. Crew neck's a little newer, so I haven't got to wear it a ton, but I actually bought this. And the next one I'm going to show you on my video where I spent all my gift cards and showed you a haul of everything I got. So I'll link that up there on the eye. But it's just from Etsy and it says Be Still and Know Psalms 4610. And I also, I love olive green and that like purple maroonish color I showed you on me a lot. So I decided to go with this color. It does have a hole in it uh, right here. So that's unfortunate. But other than that, it's just, I believe it's just like... Um, a typical like cheap sweatshirt brand so it's not that comfortable but I think it's cute and it's not uncomfortable same it's the same materials the next one I'm about to show you I'm at Etsy shop but it's the exact same sweatshirt just in a different color and a different print on it um, so it's the same amount of comfort I guess you could say but it just says faith and forms a cross with that it's obviously like a beige color and again just a nice throw-on for wherever I'm going and the colder weather day is definitely not right now in July. Um, so this one, uh, my mom got me and my friend matching. So it's a super soft black fuzzy, just a zip up jacket with a hood. And it has like um, super pretty glittery detailing right here that says the name of my gym. I'm not going to show you that. I actually recently quit gymnastics. Um, so I don't go there anymore, but I'm not going to show it just for safety for my teammates, but it's super cute. It's like teal, um, silver, glittery, and says the name of my gym on it. Um, but yeah, just super nice cozy jacket. So this next crew neck, I love the color. It's a little more raspberry in person. It's like kind of red on camera. Um, but this is it close up, and it just says Okla Sooners on it, and if my brother goes there now, so that's why I have a few Oklahoma things, and I just really like the colors of it. It's um, super cute. Again, the color's a lot cuter in person, um, but it's just a crew neck. The sleeves are absolutely massive, which I kind of enjoy, but it's kind of weird because it's not super long on me. Um, it's not the comfiest. It's definitely on the thinner side, and it's fuzzy, so it's not bad, but it's not like super duper comfy. I love how it's the middle of July, and I'm wearing a fuzzy North Face jacket. Sweat a little bit, um, but anyway... Uh, north, just a typical North Face fuzzy jacket, super soft and fuzzy. Obviously, I just have the darker gray color in it, and it's just like a zip up. Um, this is great to throw on if it's colder outside or going out to eat or whatever. This one is actually an like adult extra large, extra extra large, something like that. But it was on clearance, um, and it's the Carrie Underwood's brand, so it was super cheap, and it's a great brand. It's super soft and stretchy, and this is what it looks like up close, and I just love the color of it. Um, just like to throw it on when I'm feeling lazy, and it like can unzip and stuff like that, but just <laughs> nice big comfy sweatshirt. Everyone needs one. I love the material of this jacket. It's like, uh, I don't know what it's described, but it's like... Nike shirts, like that material, that like kind of silky soft. And this is what it looks like. This is from a meet I competed at two years ago. Um, it's super nice if it's, um, it's a little bit cool outside because it's super thin. But it just has the meet logo up there. And then I got some words on the side that say, I can, I will, end of story. And yeah, the back's plain, but it's just a great jacket to have on cooler days. But this sweatshirt I got on clearance at Academy like a year or two ago. So it's on the cheaper side, it's Nike, and I really like the color of it and just the overall look. Like, um, we have the pocket here and then just where the Nike sign and the drawstrings. There's one problem with the sweatshirt, and that is it is a stain magnet. Every time I wear it, I get stains on it, which could be because it's typically a travel sweatshirt because it's, like, a good thickness for an airplane, but I always get stains in it. And this is the hoodie, and I kind of like the look of this hoodie the way it is. Um, so, yeah. This shirt I also like a lot. It's obviously just plain yellow and says UCLA, but I like how it has, like, bruins on the sleeve there. And I like this sweatshirt a lot, and I love the uh, UCLA, and it has, like, blue in the hood, which I think is a cool touch. But I don't get to wear it that much. I mean, I could, but if I have, like, a shirt on and then throw this over, it leaves, like, yellow fuzzies all over that shirt. Um, and I've washed it multiple times, so that's kind of annoying. So I don't wear it as much as I'd like, but it's um, one of my thicker sweatshirts, kind of. So this one is just a plain black Nike sweatshirt that has, like, the same type of hood as the pink Nike one. That kind of goes down in the front. At first, I wasn't a fan of it, 
but I kind of like it now. It's a nice touch. You can't really see it on camera. Um, but anyway, I wore this sweatshirt um, when we performed at the Remaining Festival in San Antonio. So if you haven't seen that vlog, vlog, um, check it out. I'll leave the link up there for you to watch after this video is done. Um, but they're just a nice fit on the back. And it's just a nice, simple black sweatshirt. A nice staple to have. So this is a super pretty blue crew neck that's another UCLA Bruins one. And I really like this one. I like it better than the yellow. I honestly kind of forgot I had this jacket. It's at the very bottom of all of them. It is getting um, like a little bit on the smaller end. But it just has my initials monogram there. And it's really pretty. And it definitely still fits probably for the rest of this year. Has a hoodie on the back. Um, but yeah, my mom got this made for me. Super cute. Just another simple staple to have. So yeah, that's it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed seeing my sweatshirt, crew neck, jacket collection. Um, if you want to know where any of them from, you can just DM me or comment down below if YouTube allows you to comment. Um, but definitely subscribe to my channel to see more content from me. I post every Sunday and Wednesday on this channel. Um, also, be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And comment down below what jacket was your favorite or which jacket you would like to wear. See y'all next time. Bye. This is the uh, amount of sweatshirts I just tried on for y'all. Hope you liked the video.